Hello everyone, it's Mark. Uh, I figured that I might just give you a new video to let you know what's up with me. Last night was my first night living the stealth camper life in Silicon Valley. Yes, I've become a nomad, sort of speak. I'm not driving across country, but I am now homeless. I don't have a, a home, and it's all due to state taxes. State of California, because I worked for Uber and Lyft, it's a gig economy too, it was working for, for Uber, and doing 12 hours a day, seven days a week, and living in this area, you know, very costly area, it cost me too much. I didn't have any money saved up when it came to tax time and it just snowballed. So now they want, state does, state wants $7,000 and they're taking it. They've already take, taken about 1500 away. It's 25% uh, of my disposable income. Every week I'm 25% less money to use. And it costs a lot of money to live here. So yeah, fifty dollars a gallon for gas. I just got gas. It cost me forty bucks. And I only filled up half a tank. Wonderful place. Yeah, yeah. Just live here for a while. You won't have any money left. Anyway, I've, I'm living in a what they call stealth camper. Here, let me show you. It's a utility vehicle. It's a Ram City Pro. I was smart enough to run out and buy one used. And it cost me 14, here it is, 14,000. That's what it advertised for. But in the end, when you look at it, they wanted $2,000 down at the dealership. Oh, that's an extra $2,000 they didn't talk about. Well, that's because he's got to make a profit. 2000 And then on top of that, we're talking interest. And when you figure it out, the car payment, 36 months worth, it comes out to over 17000 Yeah. Right? It's a 2000 plus another three on top of the four. It's like $9,000. 19000 2000 plus 3000 more. Yeah. Comes out to... At fourteen thousand dollars, another five thousand. If I wait three years, if I try to get paid off sooner, yeah, I don't pay all the the interest. There's no penalty paying it off sooner. So I'm I'm at this park. It's near the Hayes Mansion in Sunnyville, not Sunnyville, but San Jose. It's off of Monterey Road, and I work near Monterey Road. So I'm over here looking at the, the park and the public bathrooms. And uh, I'm not sleeping here. But where do you use a public restroom? Or There's things about the nomad life that you have to understand. You know, you can't, can't be obvious. If you're stealth, yeah, you can probably find a spot to sleep. But it ain't going to be a park. Park's got bathrooms, public bathrooms, you know. What, what are they good for? Well, probably just changing clothes, dumping off trash. Yeah. How do I how do I use the restroom? Well, you know, in the middle of the night, I have to use the restroom. Okay, what do I do? Oh, well, it's like pooping in a bucket with a little bag inside and peeing in a pee bottle. And then dumping that. Where do I dump that? There's all kinds of places to dump it. You can dump it on the bushes. But the poop, you know, I gotta find a trash receptacle for the poop. And they're little like doggy bags anyway. So that, that's enough. It's not an ideal life for an old man. They came to Silicon Valley, 1984. Got off the plane from Hawaii. Took the train down, got off in Sunnyvale. Much different today than it was back then. Hardly any orchards left. 
dare you to find an orchard today. You gotta really search for one. Back then there was plenty of them all over the place. Still, there was quite a few orchards. Anyway, this is enough talk. It's just gone from bad to worse, and this whole thing that's happening to the country, we're headed towards civil war. I am an old guy. I don't have anything. I don't have a family. I gave away my land to my brother. I've got big ideas, but nobody wants to help with the ideas. You come up with your own money, Mark. We don't want to invest in you. It's a sad place for me. I'm just an old man without without a clan. I'm not joining Trump's clan. I'm not joining Biden's clan. I'm not a socialist. I'm a conservative. I'm a moderate. I'm a neoconservative. I believe in the military. They're important for this nation. That's enough. I'm done. I sound, I harp and harp and harp and it's no good for anybody. Nobody cares about me.